I'm Londa Schiebinger, and I teach at Stanford University. Governments and industries have, over the past 30 years, taken three basic approaches to the issue of women in science. The first is there have been policies by the NSF and others to increase the number of women, so to support women and their research. And that's great. We should do that. But the next step is really important, and that is to fix the institutions. Research institutions have been created around men's lives, reasonably, because men have been scientists. But as women come in, as we have dual careers, as we have new participants, we need to change the structure of universities to fit everyone's lives. The third and the newest approach, which is my work now, is to fix the knowledge. And that is really to not just look at the institutions, but to see what is created. What is the knowledge created within those institutions? What we want to do is help people understand how to get the gender element into the experimental design from the beginning. And this means that they can discover and innovate. It's too simple to ask women to make these changes themselves. It's too simple to think, oh, women will come in and they'll have all these great ideas. What we need is to teach everyone about gendered innovations and about this process that we find ourselves now involved in. We need this knowledge to permeate throughout the entire scientific community. I can't look into my crystal ball and see the next step. I want in dialogue to find out what the next step is.